I like to think of myself as more towards the end of the uh, sophisticated student spectrum. Um, so much so, I'm a postgraduate now, but when I was an undergraduate, I started writing really uh, terrible poetry. Nowhere near as good as uh, our friends earlier. Um, I thought I was a serious poet. I did English, and um, I began writing some of the most pretentious poetry I know I've ever heard. Um, I'm going to read some of it to you now. I've got it here. Printed it out and everything. Um, this one is called Numbers. <clears throat> Numbers. That's just the time. It's not starting. <laughs> Seven, six, four. <laughs> Numbers all. <laughs> it's true. Your favourite? I can't recall. Twenty, sixteen, five, or ten? I am unaware that was then. <laughs> Pretty strong stuff. <laughs> it's about a sort of traumatic breakup, and then the man realises he's over the woman when you can't remember what her favourite number was. <laughs> I'm sure we've all been there. Right, <laughs> jokes. Um, I was at Alton Towers the other day. I wasn't. Uh, I was at Alton Towers. I'll just get that out there in case anyone sort of wants to critique. Yeah, I, uh, so I was at Alton Towers the other day. Uh, yeah, came off Nemesis. Um, didn't uh, think it was quite as good as when I'd been as a younger man. I was coming off, uh, said to my friend, Nemesis isn't what it used to be. And there's a man working on, a roll, on the roller coaster at the side. He said, don't say that. Don't say that in front of Nemesis. I said, well, why not? He said, uh, he'll get upset. He's a very emotional roller coaster. Oh. Oh. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Patronisation. Um, with, with that in mind, I'll skip the next joke, which is even worse. Um,